long time no see. This is Abercrombie, everybody. But yeah, this week on Escape from Reality is reacting to my old blank. Something popped up on my screen. Okay, so I decided to do reacting to my old obsession or obsessions. I know Abercrombie, I know. They're cringy. It's okay. So, I started the internet when I was about 10. Yeah, I was 10. I had Facebook. I had uh, YouTube. And I was obsessed with a thing called Pokemon Adventures or Pokemon Special. And, yeah, I was very very obsessed with it fine then bye yeah i even had like a little facebook group that i was on and everything and yeah i was okay the character that i was obsessed with his name was silver on my old old facebook i posted about over 200 pictures of him on his birthday i was like in love with him in love it was really scary how in love i was with this character um i'll have a picture of him somewhere on the screen i i, I think i gotta look to to really really get an idea you know i to really feel the cringe okay <laughs> he's got like bright red hair like, I don't even have a thing for redheads. Oh, I'm shaking my entire dang thing. Why didn't you tell me? Anyway. Yeah, I, mm. And he's just a jerk. He's just a jerk to everybody, and I love that. I have, like, Stockholm Syndrome or something. Where I just, I, just, I wanted him to be mean to me. Anyway. The next thing that I was obsessed with was Black Butler. So, I was like 12 or 13. Um, I watched Black Butler. I stayed up all night, all day. And then that night, I stayed up that, that whole period of time watching Black Butler episodes back to back to back. Just, just for, just cause. And I watched the entire thing within that period of time. He, and, um, I still love it. It still has a special place in my heart. I still love CL. I'll have a picture of him. Up. Somewhere. Um, and, okay. So, when I was 14, I became obsessed with video games. And I was less into anime than I was, you know, back in the day. So, I became more of a video game nerd than an anime nerd, and I played a game called Elseword. Cue picture. I played this game to no end. I played it in school, I played it at home, I played it at other people's houses. That's all I ever did. I played it for forever, for all time. And I was so obsessed. And then... I met people, you know, this was probably the most influential thing that I got into in my life because I just met so many people who changed my life for the better, in my opinion, whether it was something bad that happened or something good, you know? Um, I learned a lot of lessons from meeting people. This was when I was in the phase where I was like, oh, I'm 14, I can... I can talk to people on the internet and, you know, get close with them and everything will be okay because they're just normal people. That's not always the case. <laughs> Life lessons with Summer here. I sound like I'm 60 years old. Um, you dang kids. 
don't be getting too close with people on the internet unless you absolutely know who they are. <laughs> after that, I stopped getting into Elsword after some bad things happened. And then, I am now, you know, when I was 15, I'm still in the same stuff that I was, that I am, you know, now. I'm still into that stuff. Which is video games. I'm better video games though like steam games i play steam i have battle net um i everything i have all kinds of things and i play all kinds of games i don't have any specific kind of game i am in love with overwatch though that's a fun game god i love overwatch uh but yeah picture yeah that was that's, that's what i was my life <laughs> um my cat's taking a dump. Anyway, uh, yeah, I will see you guys. Goodbye. See you next Saturday.